Today, I'm throwing it all the way back to 2020, which I know is only two years ago, but feels like a decade ago. And I'm opening up these Costco Pokeball tins. Now, they can contain anything inside from Fates Collide, XY Evolutions, Burning Shadows, Primal Clash. There's a ton of awesome chases in those sets. So drop a like on this video, drop a sub on the channel, and let's rip into these tins. All right guys, I can't believe I'm opening these, but I had such a blast opening Evolutions on my birthday, like two videos ago, that I felt like it was finally time to open these up. So this first tin here is a C20. Looks like it's a little banged up. Let's find out what is inside, what has been sitting on my floor in my sealed collection for almost two years. You know what? I think we need Lucky Pikachu pin this time. I know it's got this little perforated edge here, but I like to give it the little extra luck with the little pin slash. Why is it always so hard for me to open these? I end up like unraveling the entire plastic. There we go. Okay. C20 Pokeball tin from, I want to say like early 2020 or really late 2019. What do we got inside the C20? If I can open it. Burning Shadows, we've got Sun and Moon Base, and XY Evolutions. What is our little pin to this little Volcanion? Very nice, let's take the coin out of the way. Why'd I say pin, it's a coin. Let's move this tin to the side. Three packs, haven't opened a lot of these, haven't opened Burning Shadows in a while. So let's start it off with the Sun and Moon Base. Pretty sure from Sun and Moon Base, we'd wanna pull that um, Umbreon or Espeon GX. I could be wrong, let's get this code out of the way. Bam, code for you. What has been sitting on my floor for almost two years? Four from the back for Sun and Moon. Lucky Leaf Energy to start us out. We've got the Ultra Ball, Corsola, Skarmory, Cutify, Drowsy, Rowlet, Alolan Grimer, Brioni for our reverse hiding and upside down Gumshoe GX right on one of the few GX's that I have pulled from Sun and Moon Base. Let's drop the upside down Gumshoe, Gumshoe's GX into a sleeve. Bam, starting this tin outright with a nice GX pull. Let's get into the Burning Shadows. Burning Shadows, we'd want to pull that Rainbow Rare Charizard GX, one of Probably the hardest cards to pull, bam, from any modern set. I think I've opened about a booster box worth of Burning Shadows, and I've had some nice rainbow pulls, but haven't seen the Charizard yet. We got Simisage, Meryl, Rhyhorn, Sandagast, Hoot Hoot, Tangela, Bruxish for our reverse, and a non holo Slowking with some really, really chill artwork. Let's set him aside. Evolutions, one of my favorite sets to open. One day I will open a base set pack, even if it's just a base set unlimited, but in Evolutions, we wanna pull any of those Charizards, but for me personally, I'm happy with any of the uh, original holo reprints here. Let's get this code, bam, out of the way for you only three to the front for X and Y for all of uh, all of all of X and Y here we go Professor Oaks hint Charmeleon we've got Kakuna I love seeing this old artwork so much Diglett Ghastly Ghastly Haunter Gengar some of my favorite Pokemon of all time Caterpie we've got a drowsy coming into uh, almost the reverse magic carp and we've got a Poliwhirl for our reverse, hiding a Mewtwo EX full art. There we go, fire pull right off the bat from Evolutions, Mewtwo EX full art and the Poliwhirl reverse. Let's carefully drop both of these into the sleeve. Can't believe it, I've pulled the Dragonite full art and now the Mewtwo EX full art. And honestly, just a little, little off center, but it's gonna look really, really great in my Evolutions binder, which I think I've decided now, I'm gonna have to go for a master set of. Okay, second Pokeball here. This one is a B20. Let's find out what's inside a B20. I don't think they will all have the same packs, but I have a feeling there might be one consistent pack in all of these, and I'm thinking it's gonna be Burning Shadows, but let's see. There we go, we've got Burning Shadows, Sun and Moon Base, and a Primal Clash. Let's start off with the Primal Clash. We'd be looking to pull either the Primal Grudon or the Primal uh, Kyogre from Primal Clash. Shocking, right? Here we go, let's get this code. Oh, 
did it backwards. We've got a white code. Four to the front, wait, no, three to the front for Primal Clash, X, Y. Here we go. We've got Agron Spirit Link. Torchic, full art, very, very cool. Is that a full art? We've got Lantern. Torchic again. Staryu, very cool Staryu art for artwork. Lotad, Soul Rock, Drillbur, Gardevoir Spirit Link for our reverse, and a Crawdunt Hollow for the rare, but that's actually some pretty cool artwork. I kind of like that old hollow pattern. I definitely like that more than the new hollow pattern. Be cool if they could change it up pretty soon for us, but let's get into another Sun and Moon base ban. Like I said, I guess since that, uh, that Gumshoe GX that we just pulled. Or was that from Sun and Moon or was that from uh, Burning Shadows? I've forgotten already. Here we go, Fairy Energy, rest in peace. We've got Boldor, Switch, Alolan Persian, Litten, Firo, Paras, Lilup, Bound Sweet, Alolan Diglett for the reverse, and a non Hollow Lantern for the rare. All right, back to the infamous Burning Shadows. I will absolutely lose my mind if I pull that Rainbow Rare Charizard GX. I, I really, I don't know. Is it possible? Could we? Should we go out and try to find more Burning Shadows and pull the Charizard? I think I, t oh, oh no. I might have switched these. Can we get, yeah, there we go. Electric Energy. I think I tell this story every time I open Burning Shadows, but there's a guy in my town that went through seven booster boxes at MSRP and didn't pull it. We've got the Charmander, Panseer, Pikachu, Krogunk, Kawaii? <laughs> I might be saying this one wrong. For our reverse, I mean a Golslapod GX for the rare. All right, another GX pull for the day. Going into the sleeve, I saw that border and thought, are we getting lucky? Are we actually about to pull the Zard? Okay, so we've done a, a C20 and a B20. What's inside this A20 right here? Now, like I said, these all came from Costco in a uh, three pack little collection. I wanna say it was only like 28 or $30 for the three of them, which was a pretty good deal and uh, pretty different than the deals that Sam's Club and Costco have been putting out recently. Haven't really been as fire as some of the early deals that they were doing on Pokemon cards. Let's see, A20, what's inside this one? Can we get another Evolutions? That would be really, really cool. Oh, here we go, another Evolutions, Sun and Moon base, and a Burning Shadows. Let's go back to the Sun and Moon base. Let's rip into this one here. Like I said, pretty sure we're looking for that Umbreon or Espeon GX. If I can open this, pack is opening crazy let's get this code out of the way the right way bam let me know what you guys are pulling from these old code codes too and i know some people might not consider 2020 to be old but like i said doesn't that feel like it was a hundred years ago crushing hammer marini crab brawler ev i think i see something at the back santa gas poluag Bulldor for our reverse and another gumshoes gx what what is going on? We pulled both the gum shoes today, ba almost back to back. Let's drop them into the sleeve, the full art and the regular GX going into the binder, I guess. Bam. Let's get into, let's do Burning Shadows. We'll save Evolutions for the end there. It's, uh, it's just always this bittersweet moment to open Evolutions. I just never want the pack to end. Definitely would love to do a booster box of it. Bam, we got a code for you, but booster box of Evolutions still sitting around, uh, like $800, so I don't know, maybe one day. Fairy Energy, Wobbuffet, Acerola, we've got Gloom with some really great artwork, we've got a Noibat, Dewpiter, Tangela, Rhyhorn, Riolu, Viper for our reverse, Hyena, <laughs> Slazzle GX, there we go. Burning Shadows is trolling us, I'm seeing these shiny borders and thinking, oh no, is this it? Is this the Zard? Let's drop the Slazzle GX into a sleeve. Getting a bunch of GX pulls today, which I think was a really cool era of Pokemon. Let's get into this Evolutions though. Charizard pack artwork, they had to give us the Zard pack art, but we've already proven the world wrong once and pulled a Charizard from a Charizard pack art. Bam, here's a code for you. So let's see if we can do it again. Three to the front for Evolutions. And what's cool about Evolutions is you have a chance of pulling a really cool reverse holo in every pack. Magmar, Growlithe, shout out to Hunter. We got Ghastly, Charmander. I love this old artwork. Rattata, we got Caterpie, 
Clefairy for our reverse, hiding a non-holo dugong for the rare, but we got a nice Clefairy reverse holo that will drop into a sleeve, working on the master set of evolutions, bam. All right, we've done an A20, a B20, here's another B20, what's this one? Oh, okay, looks like we got two B20s left. I'm so glad I opened these guys. I always wonder when I look at my sealed collection, you know, what has been sitting on the floor this whole time. I've got a lot of other stuff I want to open up that I've been just patiently, patiently waiting for. Maybe some Champion's Path. I only need the Rainbow Rare Charizard to complete Champion's Path. Let's see. What's in this one? Is this going to be Burning Shadows, Sun and Moon, and Primal Clash? Let's get into... Oh, did we get a new coin? We got a Raichu coin. I missed which one that fell out of. Here we go. Primal Clash. I think it'd be really cool to pull one of those Primal... Uh, Kyogre's or Grudon's. I think Kyogre's probably my favorite of the two. Let's get this pack out of the way. And I did it backwards again. They put those codes in there backwards. We got another white code. So three to the front for Primal Clash. There we go. I'm forgetting forgetting the rules. XP share, Bib Barrel, Grudon Spirit Link. This is a sign. Spinda, Horsey, Skitty, Tangela, Trico, 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 Tangrowth for our reverse, hiding a Whale Lord EX, full art, very cool, very off center, but honestly, better pulls than I was expecting today. Whale Lord EX, I really like these old EX full arts. Let's take a look at the back. Uh, even, even a little damage off, off the, uh, the top there, but that's okay. Let's drop him into the sleeve, filling out my EX and GX binder. Burning Shadows, we'll save you to the end. Sun and Moon Base. I think we've had uh, kind of our most pulls from Sun and Moon Base set today. Bam, here we go, code for you. We got four to the front. I don't think we've hit any error codes today either. Fairy Energy, getting all the fairy energies. Granbull, Bulldor, Makahita, Caterpie, Paras, Young Goose, <laughs> we've got Shelter, oh no, Stoutland, hiding a non hollow Bruxious. I thought it was going to be another. Another one, here we go. Burning Shadows, one day. One day it's gonna happen, guys. Have you pulled the Rainbow Charizard GX from Burning Shadows? I remember, um, I think the year that these uh, Poke uh, Pokeball tins came out was the same year that uh, Burlington put a ton of three pack uh, blisters for Burning Shadows out. Here we go, Electric Energy. I had some decent luck from those. That video feels like I filmed it forever ago. We got Stuffle, Inke, Dust Skull, Tynamo, Porygon 2 for the reverse, and a non-holo Alolan Ninetales, bringing us to the last tin here, a B20. It should have the same packs inside, but I think there's a chance that they could be different. Here we go. Always end up opening these Pokeball tins the wrong way. Maybe unraveling it all like that, you know, really slowly. Maybe, maybe that gives you the luck here. Let's just peel this, peel this around. There we go, and Burning Shadows, Primal Clash, and Sun and Moon Base. So let's just go in that order. Sun and Moon, I think, I think held down the most pulls today for us, but I could be wrong. Here we go. Bam, code for you. Bam, Sun and Moon. Hope you guys are getting some good pulls from these codes. And we've got another Fairy Energy. How cool is that? Ton of Fairy Energy cards. Dragonair, Poison Barb, Toracat, Poliwag, Skarmory, Morlol, Fomantis, Spiro, Snubble for our reverse, and a non holo to Canon, but I really love the colors on that card. Here we go, Primal Clash. Can we see one of the primals today? Either Grudon or Kyogre, and I will not do this code the wrong way. Bam, three to the front for Primal Clash, and then we got some burning shadows here we go electric dive ball special energy with fairy on it tentacle vulpix corpish tynamo weedle shrine of memories for our reverse hiding a hollow mana v for our rare and like i said i like that hollow pattern a lot more than the recent hollow pattern but last pack magic we've got a marsh shadow burning shadows pack i'm not gonna say it out loud this time you guys know what we're looking to pull, but I'd be happy with anything for a little last pack magic here. Code for you, and we got four to the front for Burning Shadows. Electric Energy, Simapore, Super Scoop Up, Sviper, Meryl, Caterpie, Morlul, Duskull, 
Oddish. Crab Brawler for our reverse. Can we see some fire? Oh, it's just a non holo toxic croak but we had some great pulls today guys and i'm so happy that i opened up these tins but as always if you enjoyed this video drop a like drop a sub i post a new one every wednesday and every saturday but until then be safe have fun keep collecting and i will see you guys in these next videos